BBC One in a minute, there's bespectacled Bonhomie, as those two disproportionate frames create a spectacle spanning 20 years of the two Ronnies. In the frame of BBC Two now, I hand you back to one of the InVision announcers of yesteryear, Peter Haig. Makes me feel a bit ancient, that. Good evening. Peter Haig's still with you, as you just heard. And I must explain that both Mac Hobley and I thought it would be uh, a true recreation of days gone by if we wore dinner jacket. And just in case you're wondering, I did tie my own tie, mainly to see if I could still remember how. Now, don't forget Benjamin Britten's opera, Peter Grimes, which is at five past eight, starring Peter Pears and Heather Harper in the principal roles, with the composer conducting the London Symphony Orchestra. And that's followed by David Frost's team in the satirical show of the 60s, That Was the Week That Was. And to round off the first day of Television 50, the great Ella Fitzgerald at ten past midnight. Here, just to whet your appetite and mine, is a snippet as Ella sings, Something's Gotta Give. When an irresistible force such as you meets an old immovable object like me, you can bet as sure as you live, stuff has gotta give, stuff has gotta give, stuff has gotta give. When an irrepressible smile such as yours warms an old implacable heart such as mine don't say no because i insist somewhere somehow someone's gonna be killed super ella fitzgerald who you can see in concert at 10 past midnight tonight but now though james kethson jones directs episode 13 of john galsworthy's foresight saga a story of the changing face of England after the First World War. A splendid cast is headed by Kenneth Moore, Eric Porter, Susan Hampshire, and Nairi Dawn Porter. So, ladies and gentlemen, we present the Foresight Saga. <laughs> 